Hallo, servus and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Hold on, hold on, one second. What was that you said in the beginning? Servus? What does that mean? Once again, hallo, servus and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Felicia, I'm originally from Munich, Germany, but I've been living here in Cincinnati, Ohio on and off since 2016. As you guys know, I start all of my videos with hallo, servus. I've done this since my very first video on this channel and I even printed this on a lot of my merch products, such as the one that I'm wearing right now. But I still get a lot of comments and DMs from you guys asking, what did you say in the beginning? What the heck is Servus? What does that mean? I usually respond whenever you guys ask me about this, but I've never actually explained it in a video, so I decided to change that so that all of you guys know once and for all what I'm saying at the beginning of every one of my videos. Servus can be used both as a greeting and a farewell, so it can be used for saying hello and goodbye. Kind of like the Italian word ciao, the Hawaiian aloha, or the French salut. It's not really used in standard German, it's more of a dialect word that you'll hear in many regions of Bavaria and also in Austria. I'm personally from Munich, which is the capital of Bavaria, and Bavaria is one of 16 states in Germany. Now, some background knowledge about Germany and other German-speaking countries, such as Austria, that you should know in this context is that there are a lot of regional dialects in German, many of which are so strong that people from other regions can hardly understand a word. Let me know if you want me to dedicate a whole video on the different German dialects in the comments below. Now in Munich, people don't actually speak a lot of dialect anymore these days. As a big city with about 1.5 million residents, most people there speak more or less standard German with some influences from the Upper Bavarian dialect. People also refer to that as Münchnerisch, so like Munichen or something like that in English. So it's mostly standard German, but the way that we pronounce certain words is influenced by Bavarian dialect and some of our vocabulary is different too. And Servus is one of those words. So even though I personally don't really speak Bavarian dialect, the word Servus is one that I use a lot with my friends and family and that's why I thought it would be an authentic way of starting my videos. Hallo is hello in standard German, Servus is Bavarian and then I say welcome in English. Nowadays, Servus is a rather informal word, so you'd only use it with people that you use the informal address with in German, so people who you address with du instead of sie, but back in the day it was used a little bit more formal and it was also used by royals and that's why you can even find it in literature. Historically and etymologically, the word Servus is Latin and means slave or, as the abbreviation of a longer phrase, at your service, zu diensten, or ich bin dein Diener, I am your servant. And since Latin influenced many languages in Europe, the word is not only used in German, but also in other languages, such as Slovene, Serbian, Croatian, Hungarian, Romanian, or Ukrainian. Some of these languages pronounce it almost the same as we do in German, but then in some other cases it's pronounced a little differently, but you can still tell that it has the same origin. The word also also exists in Poland, the Czech Republic and Slovakia, but it's more considered an archaism there, so it's not a word that's still used in everyday speech. Now to get back to its use in the German language, I did say that it's mainly used in Bavaria and Austria because those are the main regions, so when you use that word most people will probably associate it with those places first. But you can also find it in some other parts of Germany, such as Baden-Württemberg, Hessen, Thüringen, Saarland and even Rheinland-Pfalz and you can even find it in Südtirol, which is a German-speaking region that belongs to Italy today. A few more fun facts about the word. Number one, in parts of Austria and Südtirol you'll also hear Servus as Servus and there are also many other variations that are especially used in youth language such as Sers, which is one that I'm personally familiar with. Number two, seinen Servus daruntersetzen, to put your Servus under it, is an idiom that means to sign something. And number three, na Servus is a phrase that some people will say when they're astonished, more in a negative way usually. Like, my sixth grade math teacher is running for mayor? Na Servus. Also, the Italian word ciao that I mentioned earlier goes back to the Latin word Servus too, actually. Servus became schiavo in Italian, meaning slave, and that's where ciao comes from. And even in Swedish, the word siena, which means hey, not quite sure if I pronounced that correctly, comes from the Swedish word for servant. And in the German dialect Itzgründisch, which is spoken in a small region in Upper Bavaria and Thuringia, people apparently actually greet each other by saying Dina, so servant. 
So now you know what Servus means and I personally mainly use it because it feels like home to me. I hope you found this video interesting. Let me know if you want to learn more about German dialects in the comments below. And of course, if you want to get yourself a t-shirt, a hoodie, a sweatshirt, a coffee mug, a sticker, a hat, a beanie, etc. that says Servus on it, you can just head over to feelifromgermany.com. You can either do the embroidered one, like the one that I'm wearing right now, Ooh, trying to show it to you. Um, or you can also do the very minimalistic one that just says Hallo Servus or the Servus Tschüss design. Tschüss is what I say at the end of my videos and if you guessed it, it means bye. This one isn't particularly Bavarian, it's just a normal standard German word. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel for free and activate the bell so that you don't miss out on any new videos in the future. And of course, if you want to, you can follow me on my social media channels for more content and you can support my channel on Patreon and buymeacoffee.com. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hope I'll see you next time. Servus and tschüss!